I was seated on an airplane not long ago, and the pilot uh, came on to tell everybody else, because I got on early, I got a million miles on Delta, and I was seated, and the pilot comes on to announce everybody, he wants everybody to sit down right now, you know? And he said, uh, because we're expecting weather, and we'd like to take off early. I'd never heard a pilot say this before. I didn't know a plane could take off early. <laughs> it turns out, if everybody's on the plane that's supposed to be on the plane, they can leave early, right? It works like a charm, man. Everybody sits down, buckles up, everybody's ready to rock. And then he comes on to say, congratulations, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to make our window out of town before the weather comes in. You know we're expecting some storms. We just want to tell you that we're expecting a fairly rough takeoff. Now, not to worry, he says, we're going to fly in a condition we call in the cockpit, zero visibility. <laughs> But don't worry, it's safe. <laughs> and what's interesting is everybody immediately looked out the window to see what zero visibility looks like. <laughs> and he was right, man. It was a harky jarky flight. I mean, rock and roll takeoff. Even us veteran flyers, white knuckle deal taken off. But interesting thing happened as this plane gained altitude through the murky, heavy atmosphere, all the cloud cover, right? is we flew and we flew and we flew into bright, pristine sunshine. And you know why this is possible, Rotary? Because the sun is out every day. <laughs> the sun is out today. On this cloudy day on Mackinac Island in the Grand Hotel, the sun is out. And the only question you need to ask yourself as a Rotarian, as a Rotarian leader, is whether you want to fly your plane in the clouds or above them. Thank <laughs> you.